Welcome to SRG Insights where we answer your questions about sales, sales management, and sales training. And today's question is, I am a new manager with a successful sales background. My manager often gives me good advice on how to get my team to respect me. Lately, I've noticed my manager stepping in on situations that I should be handling and not letting me take control. How do I approach this conversation? So first, let me congratulate you on the move from sales to sales management. Uh, it sounds like uh, it's a good career move for you. And obviously, managing a team is a different skill set than uh, actually selling. So when you manage a team, you have to be able to manage performance, provide coaching, provide leadership, and provide motivation. And it sounds like your manager is giving you some pretty good advice as a new manager uh, in terms of how you earn your team's respect and probably in some other areas as well. But I also sense in the question a little bit of a frustration that your manager is starting to take over and really doing things that you should be doing as a manager. So first, let me share with you that that's really not uncommon. You know, it's possible your manager uh, really likes being hands-on and maybe can't even resist the temptation, maybe not even know necessarily that they're taking over for you as opposed to empowering you. So I think the first thing to do is to maybe schedule some one-on-one -on -one time with your manager. And you know, it doesn't have to be overly formal, but it should be like at least something over coffee, not just a hallway conversation. And maybe spend about 15 minutes and find out for your manager how they think you're doing. Let them know that you appreciate the advice that they're providing. And then once you get some feedback, let's say you're getting positive feedback. So you know, one of the things that I've noticed is there are situations coming up that you sometimes jump in on. I really appreciate that but it would be better if you let me try and handle those this way I could learn and then maybe you could debrief with me later. But your manager may also have some concerns and maybe they're jumping in because they have concerns but just haven't expressed them yet. In that case, really listen attentively, maybe take a few notes. Then let them know, hey, I really appreciate and understand your concerns, but for me to grow and learn, I need to be able to handle those situations. So maybe I can try and handle those personally the next few times. You can kind of observe what I'm doing and then provide me some feedback. In other words, it shouldn't be confrontational. Your manager, it sounds like, has your interests in mind. They're giving you some good advice, but for whatever reason, they can't resist the temptation to manage directly as opposed to manage through you. But for ultimately, for your growth and development, and for your manager to get the leverage and really get the return on investment from you as a manager, it's important for both of you that you learn to manage and develop your team. So again, my advice is, have a candid conversation with your manager. Uh, keep it neutral. It doesn't have to be uh, that you're offended or upset. Just kind of find out what's going on, what you're doing well, where your areas for improvement are, and really express that you can learn best by being put in those situations, much like a salesperson ultimately has to do the selling and coaching from their manager. In this case, you want your manager to coach the coach, and you'll become a more effective sales manager over time and from based on your question, you have a better uh, relationship and more productive relationship with your own manager. Hope that helps and thank you.